So as I mentioned a couple days ago, a lot of you guys are starting to receive your free money for the World Cup, which, by the way, there have been some amazing matches so far, whether it was, you know, Spain, Portugal, or just some of the ones that have been going on today. I mean, there's been some incredible matches, but regardless, let's talk about Grand Theft Auto Online. A lot of you guys are receiving the $250,000 bonus cash that Rockstar has been handing out. And we talked about that the other day, but I want to talk about something else that Rockstar looks to be doing, something that's going to be happening in the future. So if you received your free money, you would have gotten a loading screen that looks like this. Grand Theft Auto Online, $250,000 cash giveaway. And it said an award of $250,000 has been deposited into your Maze Bank account for logging into Grand Theft Auto Online between June 5th and June 11th. That was the World Cup promotion. However, what's important is the bottom line that says, enjoy your bonus cash and stay tuned for more limited time events coming soon to Los Santos. So that is pretty interesting. Rockstar has confirmed that more opportunities, I guess like this, will be coming soon to Grand Theft Auto Online. Now, this is where things get a little bit confusing because I'm not exactly too sure what limited time events mean. Is it gonna be something else that happens with the World Cup? For those of you guys that don't know, the World Cup goes on till like the middle of July. There's the group stages, then there's the knockout rounds. So it, it does take a little while to get done with. So maybe Rockstar is going to do more opportunities for the World Cup. Maybe it's just more free money where you just log in for a certain amount of time and you get free money. Sort of like what we saw Rockstar do a couple weeks ago where Every day you logged in, you would get like $150,000 from Rockstar. That was a really nice opportunity right there. Maybe it has nothing to do with money at all. Maybe it's, you know, limited time items like t-shirts or weapon liveries. There's still a lot of vehicles in the game that can have liveries applied to them. Uh, maybe it's like a hat or a t-shirt or something like that. Or maybe it's something connected to the next DLC that we don't even know yet. Uh, as of when I'm making this video, Rockstar have not announced details on the next update, but maybe those limited time events are referring to what will be coming up next in Grand Theft Auto Online. All I know is that is very, very exciting. So the next opportunity in which we could see something like that is going to be this Tuesday when Rockstar introduces new tunables into the game. Now, I'm not sure what Rockstar is going to be planning on doing with that tunables update, whether it's just going to be a normal event week whether we see the Dinka Jester Classic, but one thing's for sure is if there is another limited time event that features more free items or bonus cash, that's where we're going to hear about it. We're going to hear about it on the Newswire post that actually happens on June 19th. So right now, I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments down below. What do you think these new limited time events are and what do you think Rockstar is going to be doing with it? Is it going to be more free cash? Is it going to be free items like t-shirts or hats? Is it going to be some of the uh, vehicle liveries that have not been applied to certain weaponized cars like the weaponized Tampa and more? Uh, I think either of those would be awesome. Or do you think it has something to do with the next update and we won't hear anything about it till Rockstar re releases details on that? Maybe what they're referring to is something completely that has to do with the next update and not anything that's going to be happening uh, within the next couple of weeks. But let me know your thoughts, opinions, more on this in the comments down below. I'd love to hear from you guys down there. If you did go on to enjoy this video, though, a like rating would, of course, be awesome. And also subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new or you like daily GTA 5 videos like this. Without the way, guys, like I said, thanks so much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.